subscribe our channel, press the bell icon for latest videos. Hi friends, here in this video we are going to see the definition of Poisson's ratio. So let's get started. So Poisson's ratio is basically defined as the ratio between lateral strain and linear strain denoted by mu and it is given by the formula mu is equal to lateral strain upon linear strain. Now to explain lateral and linear strain I will just draw a diagram here. There is a uniform rod subjected to pull The rod is having diameter D and the length of the rod is L Now under the action of this pull type of load because of the rod being pulled the length increases but the diameter decreases so here here we can see that the length has increased whereas the diameter of the rod has decreased so in order to understand linear and lateral strain see the load is parallel to which dimension this is the simplest approach now here the load is parallel to length so the effect on the length because of the load would be termed as the linear effect. So because of this load being parallel to L, the rod is being pulled. So the increase in the length is called as the linear strain. Linear strain denoted by change in length upon original length. Whereas the decrease in diameter, now this dimension is lateral or perpendicular to the length so that would be called as the lateral strain it is change in diameter upon original diameter and always it will happen that the linear strain value would be more whereas the lateral strain would be less so mu value would always be less than 1 That is it can be 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.33 anything but less than 1. So here we have seen that when it is tensile load the length increases. Similarly if we are taking an example of compression in that case also when the length is getting decreased the diameter goes on increasing. So the effect of linear strain would be decrease in length and in that case the ratio would be negative because the length is decreasing and we are considering compressive stresses are negative and decrease in diameter would be there so the decrease in diameter would be termed as uh, the first of all there would be when it is compressed there would be increase in diameter and decrease in length so the increase in diameter would be treated as the effect due to lateral strain whereas the decrease in length would be treated as the linear strain. So in this video we have seen what is meant by Poisson's ratio and how the formula comes from. At the end if you will find my videos helpful you can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.